Mr. Peter Parker in here right now with the homie Greaves. I'm surprised you don't have your shirt off already. Oh, I mean, I could pop. You know what? <laughs> no, Let's on. get halfway through the interview, and then I'll slip this thing off. Yeah, it's nothing like pulling up to a radio station and find out the person you're supposed to interview is potentially going to be bare-chested. Yeah. Well, That's fun. I like to mix it up, man. I, no, you do. You do very well. Last time I saw you, uh, you were out there at the Soundset pre-party at First Avenue. Crushed it. Thank you, man. Very, very dope. I'm excited about this weekend. Prof Outdoors, the third edition. You're involved. Yeah, my first time, too. Yeah. I've wanted to play the Prof Outdoors thing since its, uh, since its origin story. Yeah. But uh, it just never works out because I'm never in Minneapolis. It never works out because I'm never in Minneapolis. <laughs> but since I was just in Duluth, I got to, uh, you know, I, I get to stay here for a week, enjoy the city. and Yeah. Play prop outdoors. So. City's been good to you, man. Rhyme Sayers, a lot yeah. of good vibes out here. Everybody seems to be like, yo, you're a fan favorite. I get a lot of requests. We're playing the On the Rocks joint a lot. And uh, I'm excited about playing some other new stuff, too, when you get yeah. that uh, ready yeah. to go. Yeah, I've been working on a new record. It's it's funkier. It's like okay. uh, it's not as like emotionally devastating <laughs> as uh, some of my <laughs> other music has been. Yeah. Um, I wanted I wanted people to have the experience that they have with me on stage on a record cuz I feel like I've kind of been missing that mark yeah. on on my previous stuff. So mm -hmm. Yeah, I can see that if you're making uh, like very kind of emotional music because what I saw on stage was really like uplifting and yeah, the man. melodies that you hit are like right on. I was saying to my buddy the other day I was like there's something about guys uh, like you, uh, Mike, that, that rap, and then also are able, uh, the singing and, and hitting the melodies is like, really, really connects with fans, you know what I mean? And when you're out yeah. there doing it, it's dope. It's like, it's, it's music, it's a, you know, it should be musical. I get that. I love the yeah, hip-hop stuff, that. like, to death, you know, I was I was raised on it, but like, you know, each record, I, I want it to be more musical. I want it to hit people in different ways. And yeah. for me, I can't really just do that on just barring up on people anymore. Yeah. Like, I, I need to achieve something more musical on each record or I don't feel like I'm doing my job. I see that too. Guys uh, in your in your space um, are artists, hip-hop artists, not yeah, yeah, just yeah. rappers. Totally. You rap really well, but you sing really well. Producers, singer-songwriters, most guitar definitely. players, piano players. Yeah. Like, I feel like everybody's got that their place, especially in hip-hop. Like they can, yeah, they can dude. find their mark in that world with that. So I, I want to incorporate that more. Very dope. This weekend, Greaves is going to be out there. Prof Outdoors 3 at the Caboose. I'm hosting thing. Uh, y Kalik's going to be out there. Jay Plaza. A lot of people. Hobson's going to be out Hobson's there. Hobson's going to be there. I'm yeah. looking forward to Prof bringing the Sarah. raft the, the raft back out over. Did you see this at Soundset? He was on the... Oh, yeah. I was on stage watching him the whole pretty time. Pretty impressive stuff. Yeah, it was crazy. Uh, yeah, man. Yeah. And you guys have a pretty good friendship. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. How did you meet Prof? How did this... How did you link up? Uh, Prof... Um... Prof came on my first Rhyme Sayers like headliner tour, which cool. was for my first Rhyme Sayers record. Yeah, um, and we kind of had like, I don't know, we kind of like heard about him, like the buzz on the the that he had that song called Animal or whatever. Yeah, he had that man. crazy video for yeah. it. And I was like, that dude parties, like I want to, <laughs> yeah. I want to party with that guy. He's crazy. Yeah, and uh, so we reached out to Rhyme Sayers, and uh, we ended up meeting them at South by Southwest, and got along really well. And so, you know, sent him an offer, and we did this huge, like, two-month tour with him that was, like, yeah, crazy. And I can't believe that we didn't get arrested or somebody got... Well, I put a knife through my hand on that tour. Dope. Yeah, it was... I'm not allowed to... <laughs> Not allowed to handle sharp objects anymore, says the tour dad. Good for him. Good. Yeah. Thanks, tour dad. Keep him alive, you know? I saw Machine Gun Kelly jumped out a window in Europe last week, scraped his whole face, broke his arm. Things happen on tour. But I didn't mean to jump out of the window. That's no. the difference between me and Machine Gun Kelly. Right, right. He actually dove out the window. I did not seek the validation of the knife. In the hand. <laughs> yeah, I like, just accidentally on, put it, a knife in my hand. Yo, that's crazy. But, yeah, I mean, that, that tour kind of brought us all together because it wasn't, we were all in the van together. Yeah. We were drinking like crazy every day. Yeah. It was like, the last, like, party tour. Yeah. Okay. I think for all of us. And you and I heard you and Fundo have matching tattoos. Yeah, I might have got a little drunk in Duluth this weekend. Oh, this this just happened? My leg is still shaved. <laughs> yeah, it's still like, uh, yeah, this just happened last weekend. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And some dude uh, that used to work at Rhyme Series, he, he now works um, for the Red Herring in yeah. Duluth or whatever, but yeah. Joe... He he got it was his first tattoo and he was super nervous and he's like man I I don't know if this is a good idea and he's like shut up I already got mine <laughs> yeah. sit down and take your licks Go you're ahead. doing it and then our lighting tech Amy got hers on her butt oh yeah. 
So that's cool. He bailed. Did you tour? He, dad bailed. Tour dad bailed. Oh, look at your buddy though. Come now on in. Come in. Come in. Let's go, man. Here now the shirts are coming off. Hold one, on. One, I'll say one. I'm moving the microphone for you. Hey. Grab this oh. thing, buddy. Grab this one, buddy. Hey, Pookie. On. Hey. That's a bold move to wear sweatshorts in here. What if you cop a boner? Bro? Hey, man. <laughs> you saw me? No one can see it. No one can see it. <laughs> no, no one can see it. Prof, welcome. I, I probably shouldn't be here right now. It's cool to have you, though. Welcome. Thank you. I, I I appreciate everybody in this room except Zeke. I like the way you're <laughs> holding that mic and like kind of like dent, gently doing that. I like that. That's it. That's it. That's it. Cup it. I no. just want to swear as much as possible. You can swear. I'll bleep it out. Okay. <laughs> Prof Outdoors 3. <laughs> Prof Outdoors 3. Greaves. Yeah. Stick. <laughs> you. We beeped all of that. Yeah, all right, Perfect. Cool. <laughs> okay, cool, man. This weekend, you got your man out here. Mm -hmm. Very cool, man. Yeah, and then we're going to do a show, too. Oh, yeah, that, that is cool. true. That is cool. Hobson's involved. You have a nice lineup. Y. Kalik, uh, yeah. Jay Plaza. Yeah. Uh, a couple other guys. Uh, <laughs> Dwino Roland. Yep. Uh, we, we, um, doing this after party too with grips and grips of special guests. I don't yeah, even. Well, I couldn't uh, even. Tech spit. was in here earlier. He's we'll gonna be, be out there. Yeah. You've been busy, man. I I'm haven't way been too here. Busy, I haven't dog. been here with you I know. experiencing this I know. together. I know. I'm trying to get you over here. You've been moving around. You had a tour. Yeah. It's cool. Yeah. Mm hmm. We we're talking about you guys' friendship and how you met when you weren't here. It's pretty it's pretty interesting. We've done a lot of horrible things together. Yeah, yeah really I heard about have. the debauchery on tour. <laughs> yeah, the, one of those tours a long time ago was as bad as it would possibly get and like they only get better from now on like yeah. or they depending. get more professional, I think yeah. at this point. But those were, that was one of the earlier ones and he was you were on his tour. Yeah, and yeah. it was it was wild time. It was grimy. We you know, we broke into put bricks through windows or pumpkins, and we've we, you know we did a yeah, lot of things. Lunch meat at buttholes. Yeah. Wow. Um, yeah. I I yeah I put things into people that you know yeah. probably shouldn't go there. In I two got people on by another man. Oh, this is exciting. They're all over my shoulders. Type. <laughs> oh, okay. So yeah, it was all. <laughs> so it was a really good experience. You had a lot of fun. A lot of fun. Yeah, we came back like forty, <laughs> maybe like realistically three or four years older. Wow. Okay, we had so. a lot of meetings after being like, all right, we got to come <laughs> together. Like, are we going to cancel this or are we going to keep going? Like, who's getting kicked off? <laughs> you know, what, let's do this. Yeah. Oh, wow. Bundo's got to go. Yeah. Oh, wow. We all should have been kicked off, but then it's like, what who's are gonna we doing? Rock, though? Yeah, yeah. Who's going to go? Yeah. It's cool, though. I'm excited about this weekend. I'm hosting. Uh, Tip's going to DJ. Cool. cool. Great lineup of people. Mm -hmm. Prof Outdoors 3. You're bringing the raft back out? Yeah. I, I, I'm zipped up with that. I don't know. My, li my lips are sealed. Ooh. Okay. Wow. There could be some special things happening. It, well, it's, I will it's be a, canoeing. It's a water I, I theme. This is underwater themed. Right. So I just got a couple things in mind. You could, you take, you could guess what's going on. Throw a live down. bull shark into the crowd. That's fun. That would be exciting. <laughs> I'm going to dump one ton of uh, uh, old anchovies on, on the crowd. <laughs> <laughs> Mid-performance, just coming down like confetti. Yeah. That'd be dope. Okay. I'm going to throw sacks of chum on people. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot what chum is, and I, remi I just remi reminded myself what it was. Fairly disgusting. I liked your, I liked your so gone challenge. Oh, thank you. Yeah, no beat, just out way on like a railroad track somewhere yeah, in the, I didn't, the woods. Yeah, yeah, I was crying when I watched that. It was I was really, laughing my ass off. That the was... poetry, little. It wants me to do some more poetry. Yeah, I'm thinking, oh, so gone challenge. I'm gonna hear the the Monica beat in the background. <laughs> yeah, he's out in the middle of the woods in black and white somewhere. I was like, We're yeah, just, I'm Charles in charge right now. You're a child with SARS right now. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. I just get vivid sometimes. <laughs> no, the bars were there. Yeah, I'm sorry. Bars like I there. did research, you swim in your T-shirt. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Get out of here. I retweeted it. I got. I sent it off to well, the people. You. Yeah, it was really I dope. Appreciate. Well, I'm excited this weekend. If anybody wants details on this thing, Prof, what do they got to do? Where do they got to go? They got to go to all Greaves. Uh, yeah, um, they got to go to Greaves at, um, at him.com at Greaves.com. Greaves is uh, website.com. Okay. Um, yeah. <laughs> Greaves music. Check these guys com. out. At the caboose, I was Google out image the, uh, grieves. Google search image search grieves. This is a train wreck yeah. interview. Where do they get the <laughs> tickets? Where do you get the tickets? Um, I don't know. You could go to uh, Fifth Element. You could go to the hideaway shops. Yeah. Um, it's looking like like once again it'll sell out. There'll be tickets cool. the day of. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. Right. But um, if you don't want to get there early or whatever, you should probably just get your tickets right now to have mm -hmm. it settled right now. Right. Check it out at Fifth Element. They got them and um online. They have tickets online available. Yeah. Like there's a web there's web there's web uh, www's all over the place. <laughs> <laughs> there's web presence. There's yeah. dot coms and HTTPs. Yeah, you can check it out if you want, man. Welcome, man. Can we play some music?
Yeah, let's do it. Let's do some music. Okay, welcome, guys. And uh, yeah, Prof Outdoors 3 is happening this weekend, starring both of these guys. And I'll be there as well. Saturday. Saturday. Just Saturday. like my leg tattoo. What time does it start? Oh, yeah, I, yo, they have matching tattoos this weekend? Saint it. Saint Ben? <laughs> Saint it. He said his, his leg is still shaved, he said. Well, but, yeah. I mean, he constantly keeps those things clean. Yeah, I just smooth. I keep the getaway sticks buttery, man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Very smooth. A lot of lotion, man. Doors are at four, dude. Doors are at four. It's an earlier show. It's a it's an yeah. outdoor show. It's you know it's like a festival type uh, right attitude. You yeah. know, bring a good attitude. Bring a good dude. Yeah. You know, and just get ready to have for some fun. Yeah, this weekend, Saturday, uh, doors at four. Mm -hmm. Prof Outdoors three. Good luck.